Welcome. Uh, my name is Guy Barker. I'm an associate professor here at Warwick. I work both uh, with as part of the Crop Centre and also up at Gibbet Hill, where I interact with the students a lot as well, both teaching MSCs and their graduates, that is, and PhD students. We are particularly interested in how we can apply new technologies to areas of interest, such as farm breeding. If we're to look to the future, farm breeding requires us to speed up uh, the process which is currently being carried out. That means we need to apply uh, new uh, uh, generations of techniques such as uh, the application of genomics. We're now in the genomics lab up at Gibbet Hill and as you can see behind me there are a couple of uh, high-tech instruments. These instruments are what we call next generation sequencing uh, instruments. We use these to look inside an organism to work out what makes it different from another. So in relation to plant breeding, we want to decide whether uh, one plant is more resistant to a disease than another. We can either look at how the genes differ or how the expressions of those genes differ. That means uh, by uh, putting together our knowledge of lots of different plants, we can take the genes, which we do through breeding anyway, and put them all together so we get the best plant possible uh, to uh, allow us to improve our breeding processes. As you can see here, uh, this is a MySeq instrument. Uh, this is very good and small and can be uh, taken almost anywhere as opposed to the older type of instrument, the GA2 here, which provides a lot more data, uh, but is uh, obviously far more restrictive uh, and can't be uh, moved around very often. The whole idea is by, by application of different technologies such as these, we can not only uh, help breeders, but we can also look at crops that haven't been looked at before, because the, the cost has come down so far now that we can look at what we used to call open crops and apply these technologies to develop markers which can be used in the breeding process. This is particularly interested to our industrial partners that we're working with now where they want to use these technologies and these techniques and through our collaborations we've been able to make a significant difference uh, to their success and uh, bringing on uh, new varieties and better, better crops into the market.